Now developing news at this hour, the search continues for an escaped inmate. The Newport News Sheriff's Office admits a deputy dropped the ball. Investigators say a 17-year-old got away after a hearing. Ten on your side's Anita Blanton is in Newport News following the search now. Anita? Oh, well, Tom and Nicole, we're outside of the sheriff's office, as you can see here. They issued a statement around 630 saying that the teen had had a hearing today where the judge denied his release. Some point in time when he was supposed to be getting processed over back to the detention facility, a deputy failed to follow security procedure, resulting in a manhunt for miles. People here in the Jefferson Park area of Newport News say seeing all of this police presence isn't a usual occurrence and was quite alarming at first today. We've seen state troopers, we've seen the local police, and we've seen the sheriff department. And you don't normally see all those combined forces come together in one area. Every street for several blocks shut down. They all start swarming down the block. They flooded pretty much Madison Avenue and start circling up the streets. And initially, no one around here knew why. Everybody really wanted to know what was going on because um, as of right now, it was unusual. They soon learned police were looking for a 17-year-old male who escaped. Police say while a deputy was securing another inmate, the teen ran past him through the door unsecured. So now folks have another question. How? That there, that draws the speculation right there. That, that, that draws the eyebrow, inquire minds, want to know. Authorities say they traced the young man across the railroad tracks towards southeast Newport News, a ways away from where he started. Getting from where he started to over here on foot, that's a long way. That's an awful long way. Residents say seeing so many law enforcement officers around actually began to put their minds at ease. I was thinking, wow. The response time, wow, I feel safe, you know, and all that's right, I really did feel safe. But as time went on. Just sitting back waiting to see the conclusion of it all. Mm -hmm. That's what I was waiting to see because they were, they were really on point. Tonight, still no arrest. So that you know, the 17 year old was arrested last month on several different misdemeanors. He's not considered to be dangerous, but of course, they want him back in their custody. Uh, they searched his mother's home, no sight of him there, but we'll continue to keep you updated on their progress. And once they locate him, we'll let you know either here on the air or online at wavy.com. Now, as for the deputy involved in this case that he escaped past, I put in a phone call to the sheriff's office late this evening, and they say there is an ongoing investigation as to what, if any, any disciplinary action he'll face. For now in Newport News, Anita Blanton, 10 on your side.